this is showing the nav physics in Godot uh, a little bit further on than my last video. This is uh, now it's working from C++ in core and I've improved it quite a bit and it feels pretty nice. It uh, uses some quite stable ways of uh, doing the maths using fixed point maths and uh, that's working pretty well. Um, I've also tested it with uh, maps that rotate so you can have uh, sections of a map, say a ship that's moving around on an ocean and you can still have a nav mesh within that ship and uh, use nav physics to move around the ship while it's moving. Um, they've also added to this build, I've added a feature where you can do a path find. Um, you just press a button and it will pathfind to a point uh, a couple of meters in front of you. So most of the time when I press it, it's just going forward. But if I take it to a part of the map where there's a gap and it has to cross the gap, you will see that it's doing this totally under its own control. And it's using the uh, A-star navigation pathfinding and it's using the nav physics as well so it's just pushing it along the path um, so that kind of gives you an indication of how you might use it with ai um, it's not handling the rotation at the moment there for the um, but that's just a test um, so that should give you an idea of what it looks like now uh, hopefully i'll be able to get this into the engine soon uh, this is actually running in uh, Godot 3.6, but I will uh, do a version for Godot 4 as well.